Hey everyone, how's it going? This is Rexford here, and I'm back yet again with another game maker tutorial, and this time I'm going to be showing you guys how to change the icon in Game Maker to a custom created icon in which you can pretty much make in any paint program. As you can see, I'm using Microsoft Paint for Windows 7 here, which isn't necessarily the best version of Paint in my opinion, just because it doesn't really seem as good as the XP version of Paint, but nonetheless, it's kind of a totally unrelated topic, so let's go ahead and just get back to the tutorial at hand here. Uh, basically what I'm going to be showing you guys today is, this is my little test icon that I'm going to be using. As you can see, it's a bit distorted because I saved it in a uh, different file type, but it should work nonetheless for uh, what we're going to try to strive for. And uh, what I'm going to be showing you guys is how to change this little icon here when you run your games to whatever the heck you want to name it, or whatever the heck you want to uh, use to uh, put in place of that. Alright, so with that in mind, let's just go ahead and continue. Or I guess begin, well, I guess no, continue? Anyway, let's just go ahead and start the tutorial. Okay, so basically I've created a simple 32 by 32 pixel sprite here, and uh, just kind of drawn in whatever the heck I wanted to draw in, and then I went ahead and uh, saved it as, um, I believe, a JPEG. And uh, all you want to do is, it doesn't matter what format you save it as, whether it's a JPEG, PNG, BMP, any one of those will be fine. And uh, just go ahead and save it somewhere where you will uh, remember it and know where to find it later on. And after that, you want to go ahead and download a program called Earthen View. Now, I'm going to have the link to this in the description box where you guys can go and download it there and what this program does is it basically um exports your um, your little drawing or icon that you've created into an ICO file and that kind of file is uh, what GameMaker likes to read for these icons here and um, if it's not an ICO file it won't work so you need to make sure that you download Irvin View and uh, export your uh, little icon as an ICO so let's go ahead and do that right now I'm gonna go ahead and go file and just go ahead and hit open right here find your little icon that you created there's mine it's called test and it is a J JPEG, it's just as I thought. Let's go ahead and open. Again, it doesn't matter what the um, uh, file extension is, as long as it's just a regular, um, I guess, graphics file, so like a PNG, JPEG, BMP, anything like that will work, as I said earlier. Um, so anyway, once you've loaded in the uh, Earthen View program here, you'll see it right there in the middle of the program. We want to go ahead and go File, and, whoop, <laughs> sorry about that, File, Save As. And we're going to go ahead and uh, I'm going to go and save it actually under my desktop. There we are. As you can see, it's pretty messy. I haven't really bothered to uh, put all these in separate folders, which I'm probably going to do later, but yeah. All right, so we're going to go ahead and um, as you can see, it's already an ICO, but to change that, if it's already on like a BMP or uh, something else like that, you want to just hit this little drop down menu and hit ICO and hit save. All right, and there we go. That is all for that. We can go ahead and exit out of Earthen View, and we are at the Game Maker screen now. And what we're going to want to do here is go to Global Game Settings, go to the Loading tab, and go to Change Icon. And I'm going to go to Desktop again. Go to the very top, and hit Test, and hit Open. And there we go. It automatically updates in real time, and we can hit OK. And if we were to run our game right now, we'd see our little icon on the uh, corner, as well as if we go to File and uh, create executable our little executable game file would be the icon which we created so that's really cool and um, yeah that's pretty much it guys it's that simple to do this uh, hopefully this tutorial wasn't too long because this is a really simple thing to do so I didn't really want to take up too much time for this but if it was yeah, what can you do um, but anyway guys that's it and uh, feel free to comment rate in this video as well as even subscribe to my channel for updates and upcoming videos and cool stuff like that and as always everyone <laughs> my name is Rex Furry and uh, um, <clears throat> ah, man, I need to get some water. And uh, I'll see you guys next video.